Most homes get electricity from the local power company. And the local power company is part of what is called the grid. These power lines are part of the grid. The electricity from the grid enters the home through a meter. By adding a solar energy or PV system to a home, the home can generate its own electricity. First, sunlight must be captured and converted from light to electricity. That is what PV cells do. By grouping many cells into panels, enough power is generated to run a home or business. The electricity that is created by the solar panels is DC, or direct current electricity. DC electricity must be gathered together and changed or inverted into AC, or alternating current, which is the type of electricity found throughout a home. This is done with a piece of equipment called an inverter. The inverter is a very important part of the system. Oftentimes, batteries are attached to the inverter to store excess power for use when there is no sun. The inverter provides the electricity necessary to run the home. If there is excess power generated by the PV system, the inverter can push the extra power out onto the grid. Normally, the wheel on a meter turns one way as the power from the grid enters the home. But with a PV system installed, it's possible to turn the meter backwards. This means that instead of a home buying power from the grid, the home is selling power to the grid. And this is usually done in the form of credits. With the right PV system on a home or business, the expense for electricity, which could be many thousands of dollars a year, could be reduced to nearly zero. Solar energy systems are good for the environment, and they can save a lot of money on energy in the long run.